guys, before we get this video started, For you today we do and it's some exciting new products from Maybelline I saw these on Emily. a YouTube video Noel is where I heard about them from is that where you heard about them from I actually saw Essie Castaneda using it when she did her violent lips tattoo tutorial I think it was Emily Noel well we can't remember but anywho we Got so excited about these. We found them in Walgreens. And we bought one. We did. And used it and said, oh my gosh, we have to have them all so we, we can talk about them and use them. And yeah. Okay, so it is the Maybelline Baby Lips. And these retail at our Walgreens for $3.99 and $3.79 at, at Rite, Aid. Rite Aid. And they are chapsticks, which two of them are clear and four of them are tinted. At first we thought they don't give you any color, but then we looked them up on a blog post of somebody's and found that they, they do. They them on their lips, and they have pretty good color payoff they for do. a little bitty chapstick. They do. So it's considered a moisturizing lip balm with an SPF of 20. Which is a huge plus. Yeah, it gives you 8-hour moisture and lip renewal. Okay, so let me just tell you some of the statistics really quick about it. It says 82% visibly less dry, 94% less rough lips. 77% more supp supple and 77% better looking, and that's after four weeks of use. So nice. over time, it's supposed to improve the look of your lips. Okay, oh. so the first one we purchased was Pink Punch. And we were drawn to this color because, A, the packaging is pink. And we figured Duh. it would be like a pink lemonade-y kind of yeah. And it's hot. Scent. Pink. The actual color is the color of the tube. One of my favorite things about this product is that you know how when you put on a lipstick and it kind of has a little bit of that cakey consistency? Like you don't get that, but you still get a color payoff and just a smoothness to your lips. Your lips don't dry out, yeah. dry out and you get a pop of color. I have a really bad problem with dry lips and when I put on lipstick it sinks into all of the cracks and crevices and this doesn't really do that. Mm -mm. So with Pink Punch I feel like I'm getting a, like a Lady Gaga type lip, like a bright pink Lady Gaga lip, but smooth. Yeah. And like glossy and shiny. Can and those like both and gloss the same in one. Yeah. I love it. And it's also one of those that you can slap on without looking in the mirror yeah. for the most part. Because honestly, part. if you put it on, just go ahead and just kind of do this a little bit and it slides off like so easily from your skin and it doesn't stain it. So, okay. And the one I'm wearing is in Peach Kiss and I just absolutely love the packaging of these. Like that alone was Makes why want to buy it. I wanted to get it. That's exactly yeah. why I was like, oh my gosh, those baby lips Maybelline thingies are so freaking cute. Gotta own them. Gotta have it. So we got all of them. So the color that I'm wearing is Cherry Me, and I like this one because you almost get a red, not a red lip, but leaning towards a red lip without so much just ness. I don't even know how to explain like the, it. It's not messy. Right, and it's the I just ate a popsicle lip. Yes, totally is. Totally yeah. is. Okay, this is another pretty color. It is in the shade Grapevine, and it's just kind of like a little bit purpley. It gives you also that kind of pop Yeah, I was going to say, it's very similar to the Cherry Me. They don't have a super strong scent, so when you put them on, if you're like, ooh, I don't want to be smelling it on my lips constantly. I already can't smell mine. Yeah, you don't really get a strong one. Some are stronger than others. I think the pink one and this one, the pink punch and the peach kiss are a little stronger than the others. Still not... They're still not too strong, what you would call yeah. strong. They're just yummy, and you get a good amount of product in. Okay, last and certainly not least, for those of you who don't want the color, but still want the fun flavor and cute packaging, you can use these. Yes, you can. They have two different flavors, I guess you would call them. This is in Quenched. And this is in Peppermint. In Quenched, I don't really know... This is a mild scent. This just smells fruity. Like, yeah, that smells really good. This is definitely peppermint. 
Mm, I like that peppermint. It's kind of a sweet peppermint. Because, you know, if you just brushed your teeth, you want some chapstick on, you want all that freshness right in here. Ooh, first date. There you go. Getting Keep your it. snack on. Smack. <laughs> what? <laughs> Getting that snack Getting on. Getting that snack on. <laughs> you want to smell like peppermint when you smack. <laughs> and this quench, it's almost lemony, I think. Is it lemony? Maybe, I don't know. I can't tell. Like lemon pound cake or something. Yeah, it's but good. it's yummy and this is these are both clear. Clear. So best of both worlds. Yeah. Let us know if you have seen these before. Have you picked them up? And what's your favorite? And are there any more products like this, like the chapstick flavored y tinted colorful that we should try? Yes, I'm very interested in the color ones. Like Wet n Wild has some that are similar to this. I think that Burt's Bees I think <gasps> they have some. Yeah. So Okay. We Have will. you tried the Wet n Wild will. ones? Are they like these? Yeah. That's that's a good that's, question that for is you a good to question. answer. Answer that. Yes. Yeah. We will talk to you guys later. Bye guys. Bye.